my bad, my bad. <laughs> yo, yeah, my, my boy thought it was touch screen. Nah, nah, wait, wait. <laughs> we, ain't got, we ain't got no smart, we ain't got no smart fans around here, right? Yeah, we. <laughs> hey, he said, he said, look, 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 one day, one day, when we upgrade, when we upgrade, I promise y'all, I promise y'all. Yo, um, damn, yo, I was just about to shout him out too, man. X Van Glorious. I was about to say, yeah, I got X Van Glorious in the building. <laughs> you know, my, my, my boy had he had uh, he had something to do. But um, but yeah, man. So we, we back we back with another episode of the FFT podcast. You got your host, Cool Dex, Smooth Dex, Drop the Dex, International Dex, Humble Dex, Roller Dex, uh, Key West Dex. Uh, uh, when you hear this episode, I'll be in Key West. Yeah, that's a I'll be in Key West. Yeah, uh, yeah next sure week. Enough. No, I'm gonna be out there living like a. Uh, a Cuba drug lord. I'm gonna have a. That is that is. What up? What up? <laughs> you hey yo, he getting them packs out of Colombia. <laughs> yeah, he getting them packs out of Colombia. Best believe that. Yo, nah, yo, I was saying it before because he could, he could attest to this. Death. Every oh, time I go through the airport, they hit me with the swab. Like they gotta swab my hands and shit. They be like, yeah, you want to do this here? You want to do it on the back? I'm like, what? What you mean? <laughs> like, I'm yeah, like, yo, what? See what he doing. Like, yo, every yo, time, yo. Keep it G. Hey, keep I it swear. G. Keep it G. The airport, you don't think that this man looked like a like somebody that Columbia, Columbia, yeah. uh, chill, chill, Columbia chill. cartel. Don't, don't, don't put that some other my name, y'all. <laughs> he just looks like one of them black men that just might got some connections. Hey, yo, yo. They checking this man, man. I'm uh, telling look, you, man. look, look, look. We about we can see. Let's see. Hold on, hold on. Got the bricks, man. Let, let, hold on, hold on. Before before we go left, because that that's how Patreon go. So if y'all do want to support this podcast. Go to the Patreon. The link is in the bio. It's eight dollars a month. I forgot to explain that. That shit is cheap. It's eight dollars a month. You get to hear unreleased content. It's about nine or ten episodes on there right now. Uh, videos will be on there soon, and it's just content from us. It's women on there. It's us. Hey, yo, I'm it's- gonna keep it just right. <laughs> hey, if you broke, just say that there, cause that shit is just only eight dollars. <laughs> <laughs> if you broke, just say you broke that now. You can't afford. To My boy, all in this episode. You can't afford to listen for eight dollars. Uh, hey yo, but that 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 support the podcast so that's what i tell everybody uh link is in the bio all the links in the bio as well take you to the youtube all the videos for every episode is on the youtube as well so go uh click that for sure um, but yeah we got wop right here you ain't been mm-hmm. on this joint since that episode yeah since the last one yeah yeah yeah, yeah. so um we got a photographer in the building hold on we on you me <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah it's on you right now all right shit. well we're here it was good it was good nah, we nah, what's, up? Nah, 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 what's up nah oh yeah definitely wop, wop in the building i'm in here man you know co-hosting this thing yeah you know we about to take this a little extra a little bit thanks to me <laughs> thanks to me thanks, thanks to me. me thanks to me, thanks to me. <laughs> but um yeah nah, nah. Yeah, you know what it is so we got a special guest in the building. So can you introduce yourself and tell us where you're from, and then we'll get into everything that you do. My name is Beijing. Um, I'm from LA, but I live up north, East Orange, New Jersey. Working out of Newark, New York, <laughs> <laughs> LA, Miami. I'm a music video director. I also shoot movies, and um, yeah, like. Kind of got my own lane and a lot of shit. So, what what made you even get into the camera work just in general? Um, I was always a natural creative. And what I, age? At what age? All my life. Like ever since I can remember, um, I was always the person that somebody come to to need me to draw something or like. But I never pursued it. It was just something that I just did because I wanted to do it. So I started with drawing, painting. It's funny because. Um, my whole life, like my parents would always tell me, like, go to college, get your business degree, go get a, be a doctor, be a lawyer. And I tried that route, and it didn't work. And I was just like, I gotta get out of here. So you, you tried the lawyer, you was like, ah, yeah, no, nah, I went for business. Cause I was like, oh, okay. yeah. So, so what, what was the turning point that made you say, I'm doing this video videography thing, like a photography uh, thing? Like, what, like what this was the, the first point? step towards that direction? Yeah. Like what, what um. I was failing all my classes, and I was in school paying sixty-two thousand dollars a year. What school? Yeah, Seton what? Hall. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I went there for three years, and before I transferred to an art school. Damn. So you went. You went for three years. Yeah. And then you transferred to an art school. Yeah. 
Because I was like, I can't. Like you almost, you almost going through it, though, already, though, right? What do you mean? I like, was like, going to go like through Like three years into college, right? Mm-hmm. So, like, you almost, all like, already transitioning, like, to graduate almost. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, I was almost, was almost done. done. And then, and then you, yeah. and then, like, and that's what But I'm it saying. ended up working out because I got my master's. Right, oh, right. So this is what I'm saying. Like, master's. what made you, what made you, like, transfer from what you was doing to, like, photography? Yeah, I stopped caring. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't true. caring. That's I wasn't true. caring if I was going to class. I didn't want to be around it. I didn't want to be in class. I was failing my classes. Wasn't caring that I was failing. Like, just throwing it out the window. My so only good experience was my friends. So like your focus was more, basically, what, what took you out of it was your focus was more on what you wanted to do. It just wasn't interesting to me. I just didn't find it interesting at all. I was not at any way, shape, or form, like, ignited being in the subject. And so I was like, this is it. And I feel like it was a weird period of time where, like, when you become a transition from, like, a sophomore to a junior in college, it's like, whoa, like, what am I doing? <laughs> you know, oh, like you, that. You felt like that was, like, the moment where yeah, like, I, was like, I need to figure something out. Fast. Like, <laughs> like, fast. If it's on a fast. Because this ain't it. <laughs> Exactly. No. So, like you said, like we were saying, like what was that moment you figured it out? You was like, yo, I can do this. Um, all right. So after that, I went to college. I transferred to an art school. At that point, I didn't know that I wanted to do video photography. I started painting, sculpting, and I'm like, eh, dabbling in everything. Yeah. But it got when I got to dabble in photography, that was the one that stuck. And so I started designing my own sets. I would like look at my work and be like, dang, no, I want my work to look like that. Like. I want my stuff to look like it's in vogue. I want to look like, you know what I mean? So I practiced and practiced, and then eventually I got bored. And I, was, <laughs> I got bored. And like, um, I started watching videos, and I'm like, dang, I wonder if I could like take this model-ish looking vogue mm-hmm. set, but make it move. And then um, mm-hmm. capture the moment that the model felt in that, that moment. So I started recording her, recording the people that I would shoot, doing little interviews and stuff like that. Then eventually, um, I had linked up with one of my mentors up in Newark who shoots music videos. I started following him around for like two years, just watching him, learning, studying him up till six o'clock in the morning, doing this shoot, this shoot, running, running, running all up and down the tri-state area. Until I was like, you know, I'm tired of this. <laughs> I can do this shit. <laughs> I can do this. I was like, yo, I can do this. I'm really sick of following you around. Like, I can do this. And then I did. I branched off. I went back to L.A. And I started making my content, practicing more. And then um, that was kind of really it. When I guess, I don't know, when there was a real moment for me that was like, ah, ah, oh, no, I know. Yeah, when I was done following around my mentor. <laughs> that was it. Was that was the to, moment. I was about to ask you, I was about <laughs> yeah, to ask you, was like, was what, was that, what was that moment that took you away from that to where you, <laughs> you know, because, like, you got a little following. Like, yeah. Like, I, I want to know, like, what was the moment that took you away from, like, starter steps to like uh, make you know that you like that you, got was, it, you got it on your own right um like, hmm. i would say it was like maybe my 20th video in keeping count yeah. though, like, you, you know, nah, i just a, know the mile steps like the, word, the, word. the, proud, the moments that i'm proud of Indeed. so like yeah it was around like the 20th video because i have i have goals for myself and i'm like yo all right, that's five years. Like, literally, when you're creative and you want to pursue a service, like a career, something that pays money, and something like you perfecting your craft so that I can bring back income, you're going to give yourself goals to complete. Like, by year five, I should be good as hell. Like, <laughs> I should be, you, you, you know curse. what I mean? Like, curse. oh, I can? Right, curse, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You was yeah. good as fuck. Good as fuck. Good as fuck. You was good as fuck. Good as fuck. Good as fuck. The show called First Fucking fuck Talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right now. I'm good as fuck. Like, by, by year five, I believe, like, year one, two, you learning, you building your portfolio. But by year five, yeah. if you've been in this for five years and you don't got nothing, not a, nothing to show for, then it ain't for so you. So what, I was like, yeah, by year five, I got to do something. <laughs> Like I mean, like, all right, you could be you could be in this game for five years and you working your ass off, but you just don't get that recognition. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm I saying? Mean, so like, what, what's that? What's then like, that's the it's it's levels the to part? this. The, if you are that fire, but you but nobody is 
following you or doesn't know your work, that tells me that you're not networking enough. You're not being seen. You're not being seen, being seen. I always say that. Like, you're not being seen. Be seen, being seen. So, like, that. what that basically means is is just because you say you're an artist, and artists get into their bag a lot, like, because we are so attached yeah, to our work. So we like, yeah, no, I don't got to talk to nobody. Yeah, no, they no, you do. Yeah, you yeah, do. Yeah, you yeah, do. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. You really do. They, they, they <laughs> always get in their bag because you're creating something. You want right. somebody, you want somebody As to, they to, appreciate your, to appreciate your art. Exactly. So it's, it's just like, you you putting out this good-ass art. Damn, that shit popping. To uh, put out this good-ass art. speak in that sense to you because to me you appreciate it mm-hmm. really. but I want to know like what it was like before you got appreciated oh, like I what was that what was that like I didn't care you didn't care about being <laughs> no. appreciated Mm-mm. damn that's probably I didn't what it care. is that's I didn't probably care probably that's probably what it is yeah and to be in, to break it down I did not care because I was in a in a world where I needed to I knew what I wanted to become and I wasn't there yet so how could I expect somebody else to clap my back if like I'm not clapping, clapping myself exactly like you know what I mean like I gotta be and able for me to be loved I have to love what I do and I didn't love what I was doing at that time so when it came to the following I'm like all right like I'm really it's not my focus <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Y'all was flowing. Like that was that was dope. I'm sitting there like, yo. Yeah, nah, yeah, nah. I'm listening like, yo. No, no. This is this is clippable. This is good. <laughs> this, is <clippable. laughs> this, is, this is good. This is good shit. I'm over looking at Minimar. I, 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 I ain't wanna. I, I ain't wanna. <laughs> that was a good verbal exchange. Nah, nah. I, I like I that. So, what was it like shooting your first music video? Oh my god. Break that down. Give us the <laughs> long-winded <laughs> version. We want to hear that. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> nah, what was it like? My first, okay, wait, 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 wait. There's two types of two types of first videos, like my first video or my first paid video. What was your, what was your oh, first, oh, first video? You had a first video and first paid video. They're different well, first. That's a different. <laughs> well, I mean, like, what type of video? Music, music video. Music video. Yeah, music exactly. video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Music, yeah. yeah okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My on, first, which take one? Control. Take paid control. or not paid? Uh, not, not paid. Unpaid, yeah, unpaid. Unpaid? unpaid. My first, oh, okay. Yo, it was actually mad dope. It was mad dope. <laughs> it, just My first, it just wasn't paid. Yeah. <laughs> Everything that I wanted to. Experience. Yeah, I, I had this idea. It was executed, but it never was released. It never oh, released it. Oh, yeah. shit. Let it be a, ooh, yeah. Mm-hmm. They never released it. But it wasn't, it was, it was not the fault of anything that had to do with the video. It was this, it was the artist. Like, she, we had one scene we had to finish, and she never like didn't like she just didn't want to do the scene. Just didn't want to do the scene. Like she never followed through with nothing I had planned. So I was like, all right, whatever. But the but the video was dope, and it's actually I actually still had that video. Are you gonna release it? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. So so I I got a question real quick. It's still kind of on the topic of that, but it's like, how quick is the turnaround for you to give somebody the music video? <laughs> hey, my boy about to get up and walk out. Uh, I hate this question. No, 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 no. Let's answer. Let's answer. I hate, this, I hate this question. I actually have this this topic written in my contract. It's, it's to the point where I have to address it. That's your, that's your artist. Yeah. That's your artist. Yeah. He. We're gonna appreciate it. We're gonna appreciate it. How long? How long? How long is your, your turnaround? Turn it depends yeah. on the video. All right, listen, it listen, really right. Does. Big, listen, listen. Let him cook, let him cook, let him cook, let him cook. Let me cook, uh-huh. let me cook. Let him cook. Mm-hmm. Say you give me a package, right? Oh and you boy. say, say, listen, listen, listen. You, okay. you, 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 you disclose all your details. Uh-huh. The price is what the price is. Uh-huh. And I'll pay you the price up front. Uh-huh. Now I want four videos, right? Mm-hmm. How long, how long? Is it going to take for me to get my videos after I already paid you? Mm-hmm. How long is it going to take for me to get my videos after we shoot them? Yeah, after you pay me and I, I will. Now I paid I you already. I, yeah, I paid you, I asked I paid you, you that before. question. No, 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 let's take it back. Uh-huh. I paid you already. You mm-hmm. paid before we even shoot the videos. Mm-hmm. So how long is it going to take for me to get my videos if you paid already? It depends on you. It depends on the production. It depends on the type of video. So bare let's minimum. say, bare so minimum. let's say the bare, bare minimum, minimum, just bare basic. Minimum. Bare basic, basic, I mean, like, like one a good, location, a good, a good filter, a good, a good, like a good one filter, location, nah, good like two filter. or three, a good two filter, two or three locations, two or three locations. Ooh, but that's look, a couple days. It, it, all right, all right, that's a couple days. Well, 
basically to but, shoot but, 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 it. To but, shoot it is but, what we're saying. Well, no, it's no. a couple days to shoot it for different locations? It depends on you. All right, so listen. We, we, we shot this video in one day. Okay. We shot uh -huh. the video in one day. It's paid for. Everything is paid for. Mm -hmm. We shot the video in one day. Mm -hmm. How long is it taking? Basic one scene or three? Nah, listen. Three <laughs> scenes. Three scenes. But it's the, it's like I got the How same I got the same outfit on. Okay. Okay. I don't so really I would say go like, too a week. Much on me. like a week. A week. Yeah, about a week. Like a week. Why? What? What? What's? I I'm not crazy. <laughs> I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. I'm no not crazy. effects. No effects. Like nothing. Bare like minimum crazy. Nah, bare, bare minimum, minimum right? I mean, like, like not no after effects. Like, if the camera is good, damn, like, like if, if your camera is good, you don't really need no effects. Yeah, nah, I would say like a week, right? Like that took like a week, right? How long? How long it take for your videos to come out, North? <laughs> don't act. Yeah, North. A week. A week. <laughs> okay. I'm still waiting for your story. So, so, <laughs> so. Yeah. For him to come out. to have it. When it come out, when it come out, it's on you. But when you get your video, wait. Yo, yo, yo. Bro, I'm ready. I'm ready to kill somebody. Uh oh. Yo, yo. So, 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 so basically, nah, nah. So, so, like, that's just a question because everybody like. But it's different. Business, business. It's different. different. Yeah. Nah, like, business. if this was like a super how it, like. How is it different though? What, what makes, what makes it, different? it different? If you're good, I, I'm. I, <laughs> if you're so, good so, at okay, so we just shot oh. another video on God. That took way longer. That took like three weeks because it's a mad effects. Like you ever uh, seen like the ASAP Rocky, ASAP Ferg? Uh, but you, you like, know, you know what we different at right effects. here. You know, you know why we're going different because her type of videos and what you have she got two, some quality. two different things. She got some quality. So we saying take it back as at the beginning where yeah, like get one raw, camera. Get yeah, get oh, raw. like early, like, early. Yeah, one like, like oh, those type like twenty four hours. Yeah, like he on my time. He on my time. Twenty four hours, yeah, because I used to have shoots like like when I was really I would come home from the shoot, jump on the computer, edit, get out the way, and move on to the next. How how long can it I, take him to have uh I, the uh the pronto video? What you said that next? Can day? I ask you a question though? Yeah. When you when you were all right, not even when you were doing that, doing what you doing now, would you go back to doing that? What twenty four hour yeah. edits? I mean, no. like not even <laughs> like like. I'm too busy. <laughs> I don't busy, have time. Right? I, I can't. Yeah, cause this nigga, yeah, this, this nigga is saying I'm, I'm doing shit for Gucci Mane. You feel me? Like, so it's like, all right, like, like, but, but see, but see, all right. So that goes to another question: Is if somebody paid you, somebody it, paid uh, me for a 24 hour? No, edit. no, no, no. I'm oh, just saying, if somebody just paid you in general and they had something else pop up. Like you had something that was major pop up. Are you putting that on the back? Well, I mean, did they tell you like at, up front how long it would take? These are questions that, like, these are things that we gotta talk no, about. I feel like a lot of people don't know what to talk about. These directed about. questions because we deal with photographers, mm -hmm. and like they're they don't they're not really business minded. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They, sure they, more so, they more so like get the connections. They want to get the connections and don't want to yeah. don't want to do the do the work. Like the same you know conversation saying? that we have about pricing. I talk about all that stuff. I uh, say, I mean, look, my pricing I mean, is this. Price, this is my turnaround time. If we get this done today, we'll be able to shoot today. We pick a date. That's what we look uh, for. By that date. That's what like, we look you know for. What I mean? turnaround like, time. Like, That's what we look for. Because it, it even makes my job easier. Because I'm not guessing like, I don't know. Like, I'm scared to speak. Like, nah, you won't people talk about that. Don't now. do that, but even still, <laughs> they'll tell you a turnaround time. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I could really show you some text messages right now that'll probably yeah. make you mad as a <laughs> as a photographer. You feel but me? But I can understand why edits take longer too. I don't got no edits. What I'm saying, what I'm saying is, I can understand how somebody could say after leaving a set that it could take two weeks, but then getting behind a computer and being like, damn, nah. Yeah, like, but, but but two months though. It depends. I two mean, months? we remember, had these conversations. That's the thing. Like, as a, per, I'm like as, as a I'm asking you as a, if it I'm takes asking you as a photographer. I'm, I'm asking you as a, I'm asking you as a photographer. If if somebody pay you money, oh, as a photographer. If somebody pay you money, videographer, videographer, to photographer, same thing. No, it's still, not. Nah, it's two oh. different things. I mean, I mean, all right, yeah, because you capture emotion. Ooh. You're right. You're right. I'm right. sorry. I'm it's sorry. That, 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 that was a, that was a I hate him. Yeah, yeah, that get him. Word. Get him. Get him. Get him. I hate Wait, that which word. Word. Which videographer. Why? Why? I hate that. Why? Why? You hate we, videographer? We need to hear this. We need to hear this. Why? All right, wait, so you a photographer? No, I'm no, not. No, no, That's no, even on, worse. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We want to hear. I want to hear. I want to hear. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Wait, I want to hear. I want to hear. What did my shirt say? Direct her. Uh, exactly. Respect. So, so, so why? Because I respect them. Like, why you know what I'm saying? Why? I'm going to tell you why. No, I'm going to tell you why. Oh. So, so, so I'm going to tell you why. Who, who shooting? 
I'm going to tell you why, because this conversation needs to be had and people need to be known. When you are a videographer, that means there is no, like, creative input into what you do, really. Not a lot. It's very limited. Like, for example, events, weddings, birthday parties, uh, graduation stuff. Like, that's just, like, that's not real creativity. That's just you providing a service for somebody else. But when you're a director, you have to make decisions. You got to decide what colors to use, what lighting to use, what camera to use, what the model should be wearing, what kind of attitude they need to have, the, the treatment off rip. You're producing, you're finding locations, you're finding cars, you're editing, you're learning. at Like, it's too different, you know what I mean? So when people say, like, oh, my videographer is fire, I just be like, damn. I, I'd be like, damn, because I'd be seeing fire edits, and then in the comments, they'll be like, videographer, I'm like, damn. <laughs> you know, that's, put some that's respect good, that's on that, man. That's good to know, man, Casey. Like, put, their, put some that's, respect that's a, that's on That's good to you. know. To hear put, put some respect on it, so every time somebody mm-hmm. be like, you could be standing right next to me and introduce me as a videographer, that ass I'll be like, nah, I'm the director. That's not true. That's not <laughs> I true. I will. <laughs> indeed, so, indeed. so, not director. so my, 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 next question for you, my next question for you is, do you ever get too busy, and if so, how do you handle it? Yeah, yo, it's crazy, because we were just talking about this shit. I, was, I basically came up, like, I, I embrace the busy. Like, it was my hashtag. Embrace the busy. Like, my life is so crazy. Like, I wake up in the morning at 7 a.m., and my days don't stop till 4 a.m. Ooh. Every single day. Every single, every day. What every the, day. Every so, single so day. What's, your, what, so what's my day like? like? Yeah, like, how you prioritize it, how you handle <laughs> it. Like, like what's... Um, balance, yo. It's just crazy. I edit at night. I do my my You're I creative I, at night. I'm a creative at night, yeah. I mean I could create during the day, don't yeah, get me wrong, but, but my when I'm in my lair, like I'm editing, I edit at night. Yeah. I can't do it during the day. I tr- I do if I have to, but for some reason at night, like it's just you and yourself. It's kinda like how when you be having like your mental thoughts by yourself, like it's literally yeah. like you and yourself sitting together, like figuring this shit out. And you going through you going through the whole process that oh, I'm tired, I don't wanna yeah. be here. But then when you hit that X yeah. <laughs> I know the feeling. Yeah, I know when you the feeling, when it's yeah. four o'clock, five o'clock in the morning, you can hear the birds chirping uh-huh, yeah, and the yeah. sun is coming up, I'm and you done. like, whoo, that That's that feels feel way better to me. It, it's like a, it's like a, I, I don't know, it's nothing. like a drug. It's like that feels way better to me than like. How word. did you? Yeah. I can do that every day. I could do. I do it every. How did you find your first artist? I do it every day. Do you have? Do you have multiple artists? Um, yeah, I do. You do? How did you, how did you find your first artist? Um, my first artist found me. Your first artist found you? Yeah. And you stuck and you stuck with your first artist? Yeah. Damn. Um, most of G. all my artists find me. You a G. Most of them. A lot all of right. them. So what's the process me. behind that? What's the like process behind how do I get behind? people to find me? No, no, no. no. Oh. Not how do you find you. What makes you keep them? Keep being consistent with my artistry. Mm. So yeah. you so you'll take an artist who has mediocre music mm-hmm. if he's uh consistent. Mm-hmm. So it's not about face value. No, not at all. I have my catalog is extensive. Like right. you can go on my Vimeo. I have over a hundred and fifty. Yeah. So videos, break so break like, down some of your catalog. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, like yeah, tell some people you, from all over with? the yeah. world. Because you, you said you did movies too. So break oh, down yeah, break yeah, down yeah. your catalog. Some yeah, of the things that you need to touch that. Some movies. Yeah. So like I'm in this weird phase right now where I'm experimenting with movies. So I challenged myself to shoot a short film in 24 hours, and I did it. I just wanted to see if I could do it. Because in my mind, I always have like these storylines of how I want movies to roll out. But I never really like studied the actual art of making movies. Yeah. And so I would try to implement them into my music videos so I could practice. Oh, and now, now I'm at a point where I'm like, all right, like I, I got it. I know exactly what to do. Yeah. So I wrote two scripts already that I'm going to start executing over the summer. I just shot a short film 24 hours. I edited that so I'm just ready to release it honestly. That trailer is on my gram. And just keep building it from there because now I got such an extensive like like not to say my music video catalog is still growing too. But like I have the resources now to do what I want to do. Like I can hit somebody and be like yo I need a gaffer like yo I need a producer yo I need a you know what I mean like got the network to do to, that to stuff do that. to feel confident doing it. So yeah. what type of movies are you like looking to, to looking do? To, yeah. And have you did it? Um, coming of age movies, kind of like the John Singleton, like um, um, yeah, 
the, the those those style of movies. Like for for all kinds, or it's just like is it is it is it? Yeah. African American. I know about movies. the African. Yeah, African. black black movies, black coming of age movies. That's right. What, like, what, yeah, yeah, what, 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 what's your top five directors? Oh boy, I hate this question. <laughs> <laughs> right. well, we gotta ask. Like we yeah, gotta, gotta ask gotta this know, all the time. Or right, right, uh, Nara, you can do three. Can I do music video and? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, mix, mix it, it up. Mix they all, they all, they all directors. Yeah. Your top five directors. Bill Condon. <laughs> Bill Condon. Bill Condon. Mm-hmm. Um, Spike Lee, obviously. Spike. Yeah. Um. Yo, what's the director that made um, Kill Bill? Tarantino. Yeah, Tarantino. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking yeah. Tarantino. Tarantino. Yeah, I was about to say, if you didn't say Tarantino, yeah, yeah. man, Tarantino. I don't know. It just would have been I mean, over. I mean, I mean it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a couple. It's a couple. It's a couple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's Yo, a couple. And yeah. the director of Batman. Oh, no, Batman. Um, no, Nolan. Christopher, Christopher I mean, Nolan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nolan. Yo. Yeah. Fire. Yeah. All right, that's four, right? And Colin Tilly. And who? Colin Tilly. Colin Tilly. All right. He's a new guy, right? Nah, he's he, what? <laughs> who, who is he? <laughs> who is he? What did he? What did he? What did he, he shoot direct? music videos. What did he direct though? Everything. Everything. Who Colin? Look him up. <laughs> you gonna no, see I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm like, what, what, what took you to? What took you to Colin now? I mean, he shot. He shoots everything. He shoot most of Chris Brown videos. Okay, okay, he okay. like got the real. Creative. You like Chris Brown. <laughs> he cool. All right, so 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 like all right. He cool, but like he do Tory Lanes, he do everybody, Tiger, like everybody. Future, you know, Future has like this whole new look. That's him. It's dope. It's real creative. I like build. I like tapping into those type of videos. Like I'm real creative. Mm-hmm. I like building sets and like all that. Like. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I'm creative, so, like, when I hear a song, I'm shooting for the stars. Like, I'm like, yo, you might be hanging upside down for this. Like, yeah. or I might say, like, oh, you might be sitting yeah. on a cloud yeah, or something. You. Like, <laughs> like, you know, that's so I connect you, with his, You ever been upside down, uh, Mr. North? <laughs> he say, he say, but he's nah, been nah. in it with a cloud. <laughs> <laughs> been on the cloud, though. So, hold on. He hasn't so, done crazy yet, so but he I, will. I, I, I got a question. So, what is it like, like? Finding these places to, sh- to shoot, finding like you said, finding the people. Oh like, what God. is that whole process? Because people don't Yo. understand. It's like that's a hard process yeah, to try is. to like it's get very, very all this because you got to think you're trying to get a bunch of people that mm-hmm. do different things in one spot to yep. be the one drum. Yep. <laughs> How you want it to be. Yep. So what is that like for you? I mean, now it kind of just flows. Before, yeah. oh my God, yeah, it was, was so was stressful. Like it was so before I got before I got good. Yeah. Okay. Before it was stressful. It was very very stressful because you got to deal with the just like how you starting out you got to deal with the starting out people too that's starting out with you like the first your first round of experience with people experiencing shooting videos with you so that comes with a lot of stress because they don't trust they may not show up they might not like hold they in there because they haven't seen nothing that you've done yet so they don't know if they wasting their time and then like you just don't know like i didn't know what apps to use to find locations i didn't know what apps to use to find cars I didn't have the stain of like getting models to show up to my gig. Like I didn't have nothing. I had nothing. My catalog looked completely different because <laughs> I was literally working with what I had and like using that to get me the resources that I need. So it's stressful. It really, really is. Planning isn't that stressful no more. And then I say now, so now it just flows. Like what's, yeah, it, it, what's, flows. what's it like now? Getting, getting it's, it flows done. now. When it. There's two types of frustrations that I have and um, that I can't say that I do have. One is when like the artist oversells their capability of committing to the idea. That makes your life so hard. <laughs> I don't think they understand. Like, and it's cool because you when you when you start to elevate and you start having access to cars and people are paying you the budget to, you know. So it's kind of like, all right, we need to have a conversation. Like, are you able to get a Lamborghini? Like, are you able to pay for this? Are you able to pay for models? Are you able to pay for locations? They're like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, then you spend three to four days writing up the perfect treatment for them to be like, yeah, yeah about that location. Like, oh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get that no more. She tapped out or she did this. So it's just like, yo. Hey, it's like, it's like, are you serious? <laughs> That's frustrating, right? Because because we, ha- we talk for a reason. I need to understand what you expect and I need to be able to commit to what you expect. I need to know what you think is about to happen and show you the reality. Because the reality is that mm-hmm. 
are you sure 50 people are going to show up or more like 10? Are you sure? Because they'd be like, yeah, yeah, all my, you know, everybody yeah, showing yeah, yeah, up. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. And then it'd be like five people there. Like, where everybody at? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now this <laughs> you said I was going to be that lit. Right, right. <laughs> so <laughs> thank you. Yeah. So, I mean, you know, to answer your question, like, it just, it just flows more. Because I work with artists that can produce what they say. Uh, I get a lot you. of it. Yeah. I get you. I get you. Mm -hmm. So th this is a question I ask a lot of my people. <laughs> What's your definition of loyalty? Ooh, oh. <laughs> hold on, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished? I like this. <laughs> no. Um. Ooh. Okay. Well, that just makes my heart warm. Ooh. Yeah, it does. Ooh. Yeah, I, I have a lot of loyalty around me. Really? At yeah, I do. Ooh. I have a lot of loyalty Speak that feels it. good. Like Speak we always it. talking about how nobody loyal. Like no, I'm gonna talk about the people that are That's loyal to me. Well, like I'm nah, speaking to them right now. My definition of loyalty yeah, yeah. is, definition not, about loyal people, is not about like the people around you. We want to know what the definition of the loyalty. definition is. Like ooh, what defines die. the people around you since they so loyal? What define that? Just devoted, like like pure, genuine devotion to your character. So like, they just do what you say do. Like. No, nah, not even about doing what I got. I don't have to say anything. Yeah, so we want to know that. Tell us what. Hey, you no, know I'm saying like they're not just going to do what I say. They're going to do what they, they want to do. Because because they they see what you doing and they see what you got going on. So, yeah, because I show up for them. Too loyalty. I, I can't define it because there's so many, so many perspectives, like so many avenues you can talk about. Like loyalty is showing up for the person that you being loyal to your loyalty is treating that person the way you would want to be treated okay. the yeah. purest way form yeah. treating that there person the there way we you there would want go. to be treated yeah. you feel me like yeah. let's take it back to kindergarten nah, like. nah, you got true you yeah, got yeah, yeah like that's the definition yeah. that's what, it. what would you what, was something, what is something that you would tell yourself your younger, younger self, self. yeah, yeah. Ooh. 18 My years old 18 yeah. Yeah. Ooh. meet nimi hendrix what? <laughs> oh, I heard of him. Me, I Nimi would say Hendrix. Meet Nimi Hendrix. Or Nimi. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Nimi, Nimi Hendrix, meet right? Nimi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard of him. Meet, I, I would say. You I would tell yourself to meet Nimi Hendrix? Yeah. Why, why is that? If I was coming back from the future? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I need, because I needed to meet him when I was 18, not when I was 25. Oh, shit. Because if I would have started at 20, if I would have started at 18, ooh. Yeah, you would have you would have been. <laughs> <laughs> fine, Ooh, baby, get out my seat. <laughs> but I waited. I had to go through I life, like you know. I, I had understand. to. Yeah, like I was bullshitting. I, so I, I'm like, I, I, damn, I, I wish I would have met him then. <clears throat> I understand. Yeah, Nimi's a name. Shout out to Nimi Hendrix. Shout out yeah. the whole Secret Society. That's the team. That's my team. Okay. So yeah, you know, when dope. I think of loyalty, I think of them. Like we've been at this for years. Yeah. Years running up and down. Yeah, shout him out. What do he do? Not Director. Videos. Yeah, 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 yeah. Director. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out Ish, Denity, Nimi, Moy. Shout out everybody, like the whole crew. Like. Yeah, I, I, I saw a couple of his videos. Like he popped across my timeline, I think like last year. And I just started following. I'm just like, because like I said, you could be in the same town and city as somebody and not see what they're doing. Not see what they're doing. <laughs> hey, and then yeah. it's like eventually you start seeing it and seeing it and see the more. It's like, oh shit, like we was this close to each other or you was, yeah. you was around this way or we was around the same people. Hey, so those, so those things really start to start to happen and go. Yeah. But it was something that you said uh, before is what's the treatment for people? Because I heard of that like, maybe 2018, 2017. But what is the treatment? No treatment, oh, that's the blueprint. That's how we gonna do it, what we gonna do, where we gonna do it, what we gonna need, and you know, the whole vision. It's a, so treatment is basically a write-up okay. from start to finish, the beginning of the video to the end. But also the treatment, you know, is supposed to include the items that you need, the locations you wanna use, uh, the potential models you want to use a mood board like it, it's supposed to make the artist get the visual like you should I, I it's what I use to get artists to understand what I'm trying to do Dude. the best way because they see I the treatment you. they like oh all right like I see how this flow how I use a lot cost? of they don't how much cost? it costs to get you out to shoot get the video to get me director, out to shoot a video oh you got to DM direct me. The video you got to DM my assistant she I mean like, like 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 surface surface value though. like this this like from an artist from an artist's <laughs> perspective. <laughs> the basic package. He said, I'm trying to change my package if we can understand. <laughs> Take that to the ground. <laughs> hey, hey, <yo>. Take that. <laughs> hey, <yo. laughs> but from an artist's perspective, though, uh -huh. from an artist's perspective, like, yeah. you know, like, I understand getting into the DM, but, like, personally, mm -hmm. like, like, what's the, what's the, what you telling niggas? 
I mean, it starts at it can basic, start anywhere basic, basic. from it can start anywhere from seven hundred to five thousand dollars. Oh, sturdy. Yeah. You get some basically, shit. Basically, 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 you 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 get some sh- you get some fire. You doing some you doing like, some. Uh, but it works because these aren't the quality of artists that I'm working with now. They're like. Okay, they can actually be what I'm supposed to be now. Like. So the artists dictate how much you charge. Oh yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The artists, the artists, the artists dictate how much you. Yeah. Mm. Because you know what? I can charge whatever I want. Like, Good question. And if you are the type of artist that's like, I could tell this is gonna be a lot. I'm gonna charge what I would want to be paid to do something. Like that, right, right, right. Because now, because you're paying for a service, see, it's, it's okay. a difference between maybe, me. maybe, I, when maybe I, I directed my question a little bit the wrong way. What I'm trying to say to you is, are you gonna adjust your price? If like, all right, is, your, is my price different than NBA YoungBoy price? If NBA YoungBoy has the budget to do what our vision, like he got the have budget. The, like you already know. The, listen, you know already know that NBA YoungBoy got the budget, right? I'm but just you're saying, saying that you're able to. Comp- like with your if that's the case then y'all be both paying the same price oh, because if you yeah, got the same see, stuff that's, then that's it's the same I'm, price all i'm getting on is more yeah. some character over money is what i'm saying oh yeah, yeah no that, if you got yeah, the like, same if you got the mansion and the models and that cost five thousand that's gonna be five thousand i don't 000. care what you're i'm not gonna look at you and be in. like yeah no nah, like yeah, yeah no, i see, no, no, I, no, see no. You, I see you i see you i see it, it really starts with the business then it goes to like I get it. Yeah. I get it. Nah, nah, nah. I, I get where you was going. Yeah, you was trying to pick, like you said, character over money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, nah. <clears throat> right now. You only doing music right now, or are you still doing the movies as well? Because you no, said you had both. two. I'm doing both. Oh, so you doing both at the same yeah, time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing both. Hey. <laughs> I'm doing both. <laughs> I do both. Oh, all right. Yeah. Ooh, my job. My job. What? Go ahead. Go ahead. Nah, nah, nah. Go ahead. Finish up. <laughs> yo, yo, you funny. You shoot, turn it, turn it. you shoot movies too, right? Yeah. What kind of movies you shoot? Short films and feature films. So a short film is like fifteen. I know. Yeah. yeah. Feature but is you an ever, hour and a half. You ever uh, get like a? You ever had? You ever had a moment where you was like, I ain't shooting this shit. Yep. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> All the time. Word. All the time. Like that's regular for you. And regular. It's Word. a regular thought. Why? How? How do you get there? Like, how? Yeah, how do you handle that? What, what take you out of the? What take you out of it? Like, what make you say, I'm like, not How do you this? handle that? <laughs> it depends on how you act when I meet you. Like if, like, like, there's been moments when I walked off set. <laughs> Huh? There's been moments when I've walked off set, like, I'm, I'm out. Because artists will not, they don't care. Like, some of them just don't care. They don't care how they act. They treat you like garbage. So, like, you get to a point where it's like, I don't know who you stand, you think you stand in front of, yeah. I'm out. Yeah. I don't need this, yeah. like, I'm out. Did, did I have you, done that a lot. Have you ever, <laughs> like, walked off a, off a set or, like, like canceled some shit because... Like like they paid you. Have you ever canceled some shit? But like, after they because, paid, because, after, because they yeah, after they paid you, like have and you ever canceled some shit? Like I ain't fucking with you. And give their money back? Nah, like I've had moments where I've canceled damn. stuff and I get a money back. I'm oh, like, yeah, you it's ain't even worth it. Yeah, like here, look, listen, take so your you bread take, back. Yeah, I don't even need it. That I don't bad. even All like. Right. Yeah, All right, so let's get on the subject. Have you ever have you ever said have you ever gotten to some shit like because you said money back? Obviously. You a stand up person, so you will give a person their money back. Absolutely. Have you ever gotten to a situation where a person that gave you money mm-hmm. and you felt like you shouldn't get them their money back? Mm. No, because I have a sis. It, de- it depends. It really depends. Because I, I see what you're saying, and, and, I, and the reason why I say it depends because there be certain situations, like, like for example, let's say we had a shoot in 23 degree weather. Shoot was all day long at 11 a.m. to 12 at night i physically came to provide a service i technically did my job yeah. as a, 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 what i was hired to do show up and shoot the video right. so if at the end of the editing process now i'm spending two three weeks editing this crazy long video you want all these effects and da 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 i give you the video right you come to me and you say look like you know i don't know this maybe we like da 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 like i'm not liking it right i don't like it mm-hmm. And uh, my first reaction is like, all right, let's jump on a phone call. Let's figure out how we can fix it, right? Let's fix it. If we can't get to a point where it's like, like, like agreeable, agreeable, what I have my artists do is I give them the footage. Because if we strip it down to the nature of the the service, it's for me to create clips. 
No, that's fine. So if you don't like my edits, because at that point it's more so like you hired me to be who I want to be. Yeah. So if you keep changing me as a creative, like this obviously this isn't working. So here's True. your footage. True. You paid me you to produce this footage. True. Take it and do whatever you want with it. Here's your product. <laughs> Do what you want with it. Nah, that's and that's good. really how that works. Nah, but yeah. there's been moments where we didn't even get to that part where it's like, you know, we had in the deposit stage. Like, you paid me a deposit. Yeah. But then you like, you know, oh, I, I don't, don't want to do this no more. Like, well, whatever the case may be. No, that's done up. Like, oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, <laughs> it's not getting that. It's done up. Nah, I don't care. That's an interesting thing. It's up yeah. and it's stuck with that. Let me get that. You're not getting that back. Sorry. What's, what, what's some what's some future projects that you got going on? Anything that you're working on right now? Oh, uh, so much. Shout out, shout out your handles, everything that you got going on. Just get, yeah, yeah, like like every everything that you got going on, got going on that camera right there. Yeah, it's just so much going on. That's the thing. One at a time. Okay. Oh, we got. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> take it down. Oh, okay. <laughs> we got a lot. I got. It's like I can't. Hey. All, right, All right. Um. Something. All right, boom. Something. So we about to drop Loving Me, we about to drop On oh God, we about to drop three videos. We about to drop like four or five videos, like in the next. And where they dropping on? Era, YouTube. 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 Okay. Yeah. All right, cool. So, YouTube. you know, we, and then we are shooting videos and growing. So it's like yeah. even more, like, so that more catalog has got to be crazy. Um, make sure y'all follow, you know. Corey, only Corey North. And what shit? Where, where they follow you at? Official Beijing. Official at Beijing. Official Beijing. And, and then what, what was it? What was his handle again? Uh, only Corey North. Only Corey North. Yeah. So that's like on the music side, and on the movie side, I'm yeah. about to drop my short film over the summer, and that's gonna be my segue into my feature film. So yeah. I got two, two, you know, yeah. that, and then plus my all my other projects I'm doing. Uh -huh. Like shout out to Kirk Unicorn. Um, we've been doing a lot of stuff too, and um. It's a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, that's, that's what I'm saying. Look, whatever you can put, remember. Shout out HD. Shout out to we got to shout, shout out. Shout out everybody that basically, like, fuck with me. Because like, <laughs> y'all, because it's just been years with the same people. So it's like, you know, mm -hmm. it's, it's good. Nah, nah, like I said, like I said, I, I appreciate everything that you're doing. It's dope. It's good, it's good to see women doing this. Like, mm -hmm. in, like it, it's because we always see guys doing it. Yeah. It's always, it's always, it's always, always men, Ooh. men in charge of it. So it's good to see a woman that's actually taking charge and doing what you want and putting your vision out there and letting people know like this is how I want to do it. Yeah. Like and and, and and like I said, this show is about highlighting creatives and putting people on and giving people shout outs and, and just letting people know like look, we all support everybody. Like I said, Absolutely. you from LA but you live in Jersey, so you from Jersey, so we support. <laughs> we support. <laughs> hey, we support. Yeah, I mean, what's, don't what's get me wrong, on? I'm hey, West Coast like hey, all day, but hey. but I'm also very much Jersey. All right, so, so all right, yeah. I promise y'all I won't do this again for a long time, but I got to ask you. Oh god. Do you